Let's find the angle between these two vectors. To find the angle between two vectors, we need a special formula. And that formula relates the angle with the dot product of the vectors and the magnitudes of the vectors. So this formula says that the cosine of the angle in between the vectors will be the dot product divided by the product of the magnitudes. Let's go ahead and figure out the dot product between v and w. That will be 1 times negative 2 plus 5 times 4. We take the product of the x's and add it to the product of the y's. So the dot product in this case is going to be 18. Let's figure out the magnitude of vector v. That will be the square root of 1 plus 25, which is the square root of 26. The magnitude of vector w will be the square root of 4 plus 16. We square negative 2 to get 4. We square 4 to get 16. So that will be the square root of 20. Let's plug these into our formula. So cosine of theta will then be 18 divided by the square root of 26 multiplied by the square root of 20. And if we combine those two square roots, we are going to get the square root of, let's see, 2 times 26, that's 52, and then we add a 0. So that's what the cosine of theta is equal to. <clears throat> you could reduce that square root, but that's unnecessary in this case. Our goal is to find theta. So we are going to take the inverse sine, excuse me, inverse cosine of both sides, and we will get that. Now we go to our calculator and type it in. Now make sure you're in the mode that you're supposed to be in. If you want to find the angle in degrees, which we usually do, we're going to type in inverse cosine 18 divided by square root of 520. Make sure you close off the square root parentheses and you close off the angle parentheses. And we end up with, if we round to one decimal place, 37.9 degrees. Keep in mind that the inverse cosine is an angle that is between 0 and 180 degrees. And that's the perfect inverse trig function for this purpose, because the angle between two vectors must be an angle that's between 0 and 180 degrees. Neat.